From the earliest F-117 to today's F-35, the stealth technology of warplanes has been upgraded continuously, but one of the key technologies, stealth coating, has always faced bottlenecks in weight, durability and thermal management. In yesterday's video introducing the J-36, we boldly guessed that the J-36 may apply the latest research and development achievement of China's Northwestern Polytechnical University, multispectro stealth skin, and its adaptive system, i.e., stealth skin. So how strong is this new stealth skin? Compared with traditional wave-absorbing coatings, what advantages does it have? The stealth effect of stealth fighters is usually realized by applying wave-absorbing coatings on the surface of the fuselage, with the purpose of absorbing radar waves, so that the aircraft cannot be detected by enemy radar systems. However, conventional wave-absorbing coatings also have many limitations most notably their thickness and weight. The thickness of the wave-absorbing coating on the US F-35 fighter jet, for example, is 2 cm, which has led to a significant increase in the weight of the fighter jet, while the durability and high temperature resistance of the wave-absorbing coating are also relatively poor. The stealth skin technology of Northwestern Polytechnical University, on the other hand, breaks through this limitation. Although there is little public information about the stealth skin, but through the related technology, such as Northwestern University's radar stealth bulletproof integration of new materials, Shenfiz, composite stealth sandwich, and the National University of Defense Technology developed a metamaterial lightweight flexible wave absorbing body, you can get a glimpse of the tip of the iceberg. This kind of skin can not only effectively absorb broadband radar waves, but also in the material's lightweight, durability and high temperature performance has reached a new height. Most surprisingly, the thickness of the skin is extremely thin, but its stealth effect is comparable to the traditional heavy wave absorbing coating. A key feature of Nwik's stealthy skin is its ability to absorb broadband radar waves, including meter wave radar, P-band. Rice wave radar is a type of low frequency radar that is typically used for ground detection, but is also often used to detect stealth targets by employing a collector resistance that converts incident electromagnetic waves into thermal energy. This technology allows stealth skins to effectively absorb radar waves, especially those from P-L-band radar, thus greatly enhancing the anti-jamming capability of stealth fighters against meter wave radar. Compared with traditional wave-absorbing coatings, this new type of skin has stronger stealth performance, especially when targeting meter wave radar, which can effectively reduce the chances of being detected. This breakthrough means that China's stealth fighters, can realize stealth operations in more complex battlefield environments, increasing the survivability of the fighters. In addition to the improved stealth effect, the stealth skin developed by Northwestern Polytechnical University has also made important improvements in weight. The thickness and weight of traditional wave-absorbing coatings is one of the key factors limiting the performance of stealth fighters. For example, the wave-absorbing coating on F-35S weighs 2.5 to 3 kilograms per square meter, while the coating area of the entire aircraft is usually between 100 and 200 square meters, resulting in an overall weight gain of 250 to 600 kilograms. On the other hand, China's newly developed stealth skin is only 0.2 millimeters thick, which significantly reduces the weight and can effectively lower the total weight of the fighter jet. Lightweight design not only enhances the flight performance of stealth fighters, but also provides more load space for the fighters allowing them to carry more weapon systems and electronic equipment. Lighter warplanes mean higher maneuverability, flexibility and longer combat radius, further enhancing their tactical advantages. Another technical bottleneck that needs to be broken through is the high temperature resistance of stealth fighters. Stealth coatings are usually poorly resistant to high temperatures, especially when flying at high speeds. The surface temperature of the warplane will rise rapidly, which poses a huge challenge to the stability and service life of the coating. Northwestern Polytechnical University's stealth skin uses the radar stealth bulletproof integration of new materials developed by North University. Making the skin has a stronger heat resistance and stability at high temperatures. The introduction of this new material not only significantly improves the strength of the stealth skin, but also makes the warplane can continue to operate at higher temperatures, breaking through the bottleneck of the thermal barrier of the traditional stealth warplanes. This technological advancement means that future stealth fighters will be able to maintain their stealth status more stably when flying at hypersonic speeds, 
while reducing coating peeling or performance degradation due to high temperatures. In addition to the above advantages, NWI's stealthy skin is also self-adaptive. Based on changes in the battlefield environment, the stealth skin is able to adjust its shape and structure to respond to different types of radar waves and other detection methods. This capability allows stealth fighters to flexibly respond to multiple threats in complex battlefield environments and maintain optimal stealth at all times. This multi-spectrum stealth skin and its adaptive system has a very strong comprehensive ability in visual, infrared and even radar wave multiband stealth. If this technology is successfully put into use, China's sixth generation aircraft may no longer rely on traditional wave absorbing coatings, but through this highly integrated stealth skin system, to maintain the stealth effect in different frequency bands and greatly enhance the survivability and operational flexibility of the warplane. With the maturity of stealth skin technology, the maintenance and cost of stealth fighters have also been effectively solved. The traditional wave absorbing coating needs to be frequently repaired and ray coated during the combat process which not only increases the maintenance cost, but also makes it difficult to maintain the combat readiness of stealth fighters. The new stealth skin has stronger durability, which can reduce the number of maintenance and lower combat costs. In addition, the manufacturing cost of the stealth skin is also relatively low. Compared with the traditional wave absorbing coating, the use of this skin will save a lot of money in the production and maintenance and improve the overall combat effectiveness. All in all, in WIUs, Multispectral stealth skin and its adaptive system provide strong technical support for the development of China's sixth generation aircraft. The comprehensive improvement of this stealth skin in stealth performance, flight performance, heat resistance, maintenance, and other aspects marks China's leapfrog progress in the field of stealth technology. The emergence of stealth skin will make China's sixth generation aircraft in the future air war to occupy a clear advantage, not only in the stealth effect beyond the existing warplanes but also in the comprehensive performance of the formation of technical barriers, even if the shape of the warplanes of other countries are similar to achieve similar performance.